guys welcome back to another lit video it's your girl lerato period oh grrr. make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up comment in the comment section don't forget to turn on your post notifications and hit that subscribe button and for today's video we're going to be reacting to this whole russia and ukraine situation that's been all over the news especially cnn if you want to check out more updates on what's going on just watch cnn and this is like it's like from the morning until the night Russian Ukraine, Russian Ukraine. So you won't even miss this beat. So we're gonna be reacting to Russia launches attack on Ukraine overnight. Yo. But without further ado, let's get into the video because this is like yo. Yo. I, I really Russia think. overnight launched its long anticipated attack on Ukraine, striking military oh, posts across the country. An unprovoked war in Europe is now underway. The assault began with an angry message from President Vladimir Putin broadcast in the middle of the night. Russia cannot feel safe, develop, and exist with a constant threat emanating from the territory of modern Ukraine, he said, describing the government in Kiev as a junta of neo-Nazis determined to build nuclear weapons. As Putin spoke, seemingly on cue, Russian bombs what? started falling. Crews and ballistic missiles, Ukrainian officials said, along with attack helicopters striking military installations, including air bases near the capital, Kiev. And more military targets in several other Ukrainian cities, what? including Kharkiv, the biggest city in eastern Ukraine. Russia claimed to have eliminated much of Ukraine's defenses. But the Russian reports so they appear exaggerated. For the army pieces. Several videos showed what Ukrainian officials described as columns of Russian tanks entering Ukrainian territory. A potentially devastating war in Ukraine has just begun. But so far it appears Look to be a gradual assault. Putin, who said he does not want to occupy the country, may be trying to take Ukraine without having to fight hard for it, appealing to the military so he wants to not take to resist. Ukraine. But there are no signs Ukrainians are raising the white flag. We need advice. President Zelensky, in a pre-dawn appeal, told Ukrainians to stay strong and calm as he announced the start of martial law. While some Ukrainians in Kiev were heading out of the capital, many are determined to stay and resist. In Mariupol, people this morning were stocking up on cash with long lines in the ATMs. How are you feeling? I'm nervous, and I'm trying to keep my children calm, said Yulia. Putin says he's doing Ukrainians a favor by trying to get rid of their Nazi fascist government. What do you, what do you think about that? We don't need his protection, she said, and dismissed Putin's claims as lies. Supermarkets were flooded too. 45-minute waits for checkout. This is our Ukraine. I'm staying. I'm calm. I'm even smiling, said Ivan. Ukraine has mobilized its forces and begun to defend its cities. The government is calling for urgent blood donations to treat the growing but still unclear number of casualties. Putin, in his message that launched this military offensive, seemed to have a special message for the United States, reminding the world that Russia is a nuclear power what? and said that anyone that tried to stop Russia's actions would face terrible consequences. So Russia Richard Angle is just there. Angry. Richard, thank you. Russia is like just mad. They're like, I'm mad and I'm going to make sure that I'm going to show all these countries, these people that I'm mad. Like, what are you trying to achieve? What? Like, he, so this whole thing basically started because the president of Russia felt threatened. So he's like, you know what, I'm gonna attack first before they attack, even though Ukraine is not even attacking. So they're bombing their facilities, the army stations and whatever. So basically they don't even want Ukraine to be in a position to even defend themselves. Like what is going on in this world? Like honestly, like what's next? A zombie apocalypse? COVID, World War Three, the zombie apocalypse. Like, what is next? Like, things are just like always getting worse and worse and worse. Like, I don't even know what to say. Like, did you see the lines at the ATM? 
Did you see? Like, imagine the last person. Because in every ATMs, you have to continuously fill. I hope those people even go. Like, like, what do you even do in that situation? Like, how much money do you have to take out of the ATM to have enough? Because you don't even know how worse things are going to get. How much food do you have to buy until you feel comfortable enough with that? This is going to last me. Like, if you're even staying at a refugee, when are you even going to have time to go back to a supermarket? When? I honestly don't understand why this is happening. It's just, I don't know, it's like the world is slowly coming to an end. That's the only, like, conclusion I have on the situation. Like, everything is just, just happening, just like the economist said in the previous video. Like, one night, one day, everything was perfectly fine, and then the next morning... People are waking up to sirens and bombs being dropped. Like imagine you you sleeping at home and you just hear a bomb down the street. You just hear a bomb down the street. I, I don't even know what to say. I'm, I'm, it's like it's like it's a movie. I mean, these things happen in movies. Like and so many people are dying. Like so many people. Are, imagine you have kids. Imagine you're a parent and you have kids. Like. Like, what do you do? I'm just thinking about the stress that these people are in. People are distressed right now. But at least, because I heard on the news it said that um, America is going to try and help Ukraine. And Russia is like, you know what? You can call America. You can call. We are like, we are going to go for all of you. Putin is just not, he's, he's not going to rest. Wow. But without further ado, make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up. Comment your thoughts on this. And honestly, comment your thoughts on this whole situation. And don't forget to turn your post notifications and hit the subscribe button. It's your girl, NLL.